everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my February favorites and this is kind of like really overdue because it's currently like March 10th. So I'm really sorry but I just haven't been into that and um, I'm sorry and my hair, I cut my hair today, my mom just cut it and I really like it so I was like why not film a video, am I right? Um, so I have like a bunch of stuff behind me. Okay, so I'm going to start off with like makeup products. And then um, move on into other things. So um, I actually have a list because I am prepared and I have a list of my favorites so that I didn't forget. Because for some reason I always forget when I'm filming like what I'm talking about. So for makeup, makeup I've actually tried out, I just whistled, um, I've actually been trying out new makeup recently from Sephora. So I've been spending lots on this makeup and thank God that it's all really nice makeup because... Um, I like all of it and it's all part of my favorites, so I'm going to start off with my foundation. This is my new favorite foundation. It kind of, I feel like it makes me look a little bit orange, but if I like, I feel like it's just because I'm so extremely white that literally nothing matches me. So if I blend it like down my neck, then it matches better and I really don't like my hair straight, but I didn't want to straighten it. So, I mean, I didn't want to curl it, so whatever um this is the Kat Von D Lock It Tattoo Foundation it's extremely full coverage you only need one pump oops for your entire face and it covers flawlessly and I absolutely love it and I use my beauty blender to blend it and it's $34 and it's definitely worth the money plus it's I like the packaging it's really sleek and stuff and I'm not wearing a bra I'm wearing a sports bra because I am like the epitome of lazy, so. Next, I have another Kat Von D product, and this is the Kat Von D Locket, and uh, it's not Locket, this is the Tattoo Liner. Um, I use this just to line like my eyes, and then I use a different one for my wings, which is just like whatever, but I guess I'll share that with you too. Um, so to actually line my eyes, um, I use the Kat Von D one because it's a lot smoother, and it doesn't like leave like bumps and it's a lot, it glides on a lot easier onto my like lash line. But to make my wings, I use my Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liner and that just makes a more precise wing because this one is like literally a brush that's into a tip so it like comes apart sometimes. But this is really, really good for making the perfect um, like sharp edge. So these two together are what I use to do my eyeliner. So, woo. And then I've been wearing eyeshadow recently, which I used to never do, but I've been like trying out new looks and stuff. <laughs> so I've been using my Coastal Sense Revealed palette that I got in um in a BoxyCharm box. So I really, really like this. This is a very nice palette and I like the array of colors. There's like, um, like browns, there's like cool tone browns, warm browns, um, like lid colors, there's shimmery colors, there's matte colors, there's blues, there's oranges and coppers and like there's a black, there's literally, this is the ideal palette for me because I really only wear like neutral things so this is like my favorite. I like this better than the Naked 2 palette because I feel like it has more of a variety um, obviously because it also has more colors than the Naked 2 but yeah I've been loving that. Next for fashion favorites, I have a few things, so yeah, um, I've been wearing this jacket all the time, you cannot get it anymore, it's by the Miley Cyrus line from Walmart, which I got like a million years ago, but I really like like the, the collar of this, it smells really good because I obviously wear it and I, I like my perfume, <laughs> um, and it has like a nice zipper there and then it has this like cinching thing and the back part so it like just looks really nice on it's really comfortable and I like it a lot it's like my warmer one um yeah so next I have my cat vans and these I need to wash them because they're starting to get really dirty because I wear them literally like everywhere I wear them to work to go out to do anything I love them um, they're my new go-to's. My other ones were my, I don't, they're not near me, but my black and white ones, those were my go-to's. And now literally these are, these go with everything and they're just, they're so cute. I got them for someone from their birthday and it, they love them and it was really cool and everyone should have cat vans. Go buy them. They're 
$55, but they're so cute and I love them so much. And I'm not going to put them near my face, but yeah, they're really, really dirty. So I'm probably going to wash them soon because they're super faded. And um, they're not faded, they're just like dirty, so they're not as vibrant. Because like, when I got like, um, the person, their vans, his are like way nicer. So mine are like super dirty. And that makes me sad, so I have to wash them now because his are like so bright and pretty and mine are like what is this you know next I have these jeans these jeans I've been wearing a lot I've actually been keeping them in my car so that whenever like I'm coming home from work and I want to go straight out um I usually wear sweatshirts which I'm fine with but my khakis are just so ugly and I hate them so much so I've been changing into these a lot <laughs> so I literally just brought these out of my car they they smell like my car because my car smells like mahogany teak wood so these smell like mahogany teak wood from Bath and Body Works and these are just my distressed, um, I don't know what's happening with my tripod right now, but it's moving. Um, they're just the distressed jeans from Forever 21 that I got when I was in Boston. So I'm obsessed with them, and they're really comfortable, and they're very easy to change into, and they're very basic. But they're still a little cool because they got rips in them, so, yeah. And then, oh, I've been wearing my Ray-Bans a lot, um... These are just my aviator ones, and I've been loving them. I've been wearing some- Ah! Oh my god, I got it stuck on my- Oh my god. <laughs> that are really bad. I got them- I got it stuck on my industrial. Oh, this is a favorite, this ring. Except, um, this not- it's not a ring, it's a barbell. But it hurts really bad because it's too long for me, but I like it a lot. And I like these a lot. These are the polarized ones, and they're very nice for driving in because- yeah, um, except I don't like that these little, like, cushions leave, like, red marks on my nose, so that's kind of annoying, but these have been a favorite. Next, I guess I'll do food favorites. Oh, no, my pink, my purse, my purse. Hold on. This has so been a favorite. I got this from Goodwill, actually, because Goodwill gets Target shipments, if you didn't know, and I worked there, and I saw it, and I was like, I need it. Um, so, yeah, it's just, like, the... Morona pink purse. They don't have this color anymore. They have like a pastel color, which sucks. Um, but yeah, this has been my favorite. I've been using this. This is like my pop of color because as you all know, I don't wear color. When do I ever wear color? Let's be real. Um, so this is like my pop of color. I also have this bag in black. So if I'm wearing color, I'll just switch it with my black one. And I'm going to do a what's on my, what's in my purse video. So stay tuned for that. Um, woo, that's been a favorite. Okay, now for food favorites. I don't have them with me, but I will tell you. The Frosted Animal Crackers. I actually left them in my locker at work, which I'm hella pissed about because I really want them now. But um, those have been my favorite. I've been eating them like crazy. They're just so good. And mozzarella sticks. Mozzarella sticks, my life revolves around mozzarella sticks. Um, the ones from 99 and from Buffalo Wild Wings are like, ooh, they're like way up there. There's this like little drive-in place near my job where they have really good mozzarella sticks but I don't get them there often because they're not as good but um, mozzarella sticks in general are just so good and I love them so much like I, I I love mozzarella sticks me and my friend Angela we're like obsessed I'm pretty sure we're gonna get them today so mozzarella sticks are just mozzarella sticks make my world go round literally um, now for random favorites. I have a Poshmark. I have not announced this, but I've had Poshmark for like a pretty long time, like a couple weeks. So, if you do not know I had Poshmark, if you don't follow me on Twitter, you wouldn't know, but I'm selling a bunch of my stuff. I'm still like currently listing things. I kind of put out stuff like, I don't know, once a day, like every other day. I put a few things out. Um, and yeah, so definitely check out my Poshmark. I'll have it like linked down below. I'm actually selling these Ray-Bans, which I wanted to tell you guys about because this is like probably the best thing on my Poshmark. Um, I, you guys know about these. I've never really wore them that often. They're my cat eye ones. Um, everything is new. It's like packaged and everything like this is in here. Um, they're not polarized. They're just the gray gradient ones and... All the information about them is on my Poshmark, so if you want to buy them, go ahead and check them out. They're, like, brand new, and, um, yeah, so, that's a little sneak peek to what I'm selling. I'm also selling a lot of iPhone 5 cases, so, yeah, check that out. I have, what the, 
Um, I was absolutely obsessed with American Horror Story Asylum. I decided, I never really watched it when it came out. I thought it was stupid. But then I finally, like, sat down and was, like, started watching it. And I got super into it. And I'm really sad that it was so short. And I'm really sad that, like, American Horror Story in general is just so short. But it is definitely my favorite. And I love it so much. It was my favorite season out of all of them. I still have not watched Freak Show because I just think that one is really stupid. And I don't know if I'm ever going to watch that. But, um, Coven was my favorite because yeah I'm um, also taking baths uh, lush became a huge thing again and I'm gonna film a haul like I have I got a lot of lush stuff which I'm gonna film a haul with um so stay tuned for that this will be up before that because this is way more important than that um yeah taking baths has been huge and um like bath bombs and bubble bars and everything has been just like oh, I love it so much I love taking baths taking baths during the day though like, at night, it's different, but in the day, I feel like it's more relaxing. It's like, yes, priorities are, like, irrelevant right now. Like, I'm taking a bath at, like, 11 a.m. It's the best. Um, but, yeah, so those are all of my favorites for the month of March. February. For the month of February. Also, wearing rings has been a uh, favorite. Um, yeah, that's all that I can really think of right now, so... I'm gonna go and yeah I will speak to you all in my next video I'm gonna go film more I'm probably gonna be wearing the same thing in the next three videos because what's the point of changing like seriously I like this shirt so I'm gonna keep wearing it um yeah so I'm gonna talk to you guys in my next video I hope you guys like my shorter hair I think it's pretty neat anyways um yeah so I love you guys hope you enjoyed uh let me know what videos you want to see from me next and yeah, bye. <laughs>